Yeah, so today coming in at about 3.30, I'll um, get some strapping done just shortly after this and then head into the gym or out onto Gosh's and do a craft session, which is sort of technique based training. Um, might only go for half an hour, it's pretty stationary with a coach or a few teammates just to work on a few things fundamentally. Come into the gym, do some warm up stuff, a couple of team meetings that could be as a line group. So I could meet with the midfield group and we go through things in terms of mid midfield line. It could be whole team stuff and you go through your focuses for the week. After that, you do sort of a group warm up and then out in the track. So we'll train then for a couple of hours, come back in, hit the gym, do some weights, recovery, dinner, home time. And it's definitely bedtime after that. It's a, it's a pretty long time when you're here, um, but it's, it's got to be because otherwise you're, you're wasting crucial time. So it's really great to get in here and maximise all these little opportunities that we get given. Yeah, we're only a month away now, so training is a lot more game style stuff. So there's a lot of uh, full ground drills and we cover most of our distance and those sort of things. Um, but it is nice that training's become a lot more competitive there's a lot more physicality to our training drills and we're using more of the ground. So it's definitely becoming a lot more game-like, which I think the girls love to show their competitive edge and put their best foot forward. Obviously not ideal that we've finished third the last couple of years, but it's not something you think about. I guess it is a bit of a driving factor subconsciously that we know we don't want to be in that position again and um, doing our best to continually get better and make sure that we can maximise people we've got in our group and the talent that we've got. So we're not, you know, thinking we can't finish third again, but I guess subconsciously it's a bit of a driving factor that we want to make top two and hopefully take out the flag.